Wednesday, get involved with Khan Dance Got Talents. <laughs> Tomorrow, our judge will be the Don Raja Apache Indian. And Friday, listen to my interview from London Miller with world champion boxer Amir Khan. The worst Asian dish is aubergines. I don't like them. Noreen Khan, weekdays from three on the BBC Asian Network. So, if you've been suffering from colds like we have on the team here, and we've really been suffering, we've um, t- talked you through an immune-boosting curry that contains as much vitamin C as found in 30 oranges, courtesy of our superfood guru and hero, Gurupreet Bains. Yay, that's me. That's him. That's, <laughs> that's him. You don't mistake. There's only one of you in the world. Yeah. And um, we've At gone through the whole recipe. And and also, where can people find the recipe, by okay. the way? If, now, uh, if, you, if, if they've missed it because I do talk a bit a little bit fast um, I'm Punjabi okay so it's um, www.britainsbiggestcurryparty.org uh, again, Britain's Biggest Curry Party.org. And if you like the recipe after you've cooked it, you can always buy my book, Indian Superfood. And um, I, like, I love the subtle plugging, man. The subtle plugging, yeah. We've got to because we've got to keep it up the top, you know. And it, no, it's, it's a true. good thing for the Asian, uh, for us as a, Asian people. And yes. I mean, I wanted to talk, uh, should Gubs taste this first or should I talk about yes. why I made Let's this recipe? Let's just introduce Gu- Gubs Hay. Yeah. I introduced oh it to everybody right. last week um, because he's new on the team now. He's, he's worked here for a long too. time. But you, first time you've met Gubs. So Gubs yeah. meet Gurpreet, Gurpreet meet Gubs. Hi. Hi, 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 Gubs. <laughs> Gubs in the detox. <laughs> now, Gubs is tasting the curry okay. because... It smells amazing. Does it? Yeah. yeah. You're tasting curry because I'm strict vegetarian and we'll, so won't eat salmon. Yes, yes please. Yes, please. Bon Did appetit. Or oh, chak de fak de. Oh, yeah. All right, there you go. Oh, I don't even drop yeah. them. So dun, it looks very colourful. You've got, you've got dun, rice dun, dun, and the salmon dun, curry. On the yeah. on the on the plate there. Some of the salmon. Holder. We've got some coriander on the side. Yeah. We've got juniper berries there, and and the colour is coming from the passata, so condensed tomato. And when you cook, it that, looks lovely. I have to say, great colour. Mm. Mm. Really, really good. Yeah. Yeah. More, please. Ah, oh, juniper berries are nice. Yeah. What does it taste now, like does it, compared to a regular curry I'll that go you and have, have a with spoon. you? And um, what does it taste? It just tastes really nice. You can taste the flavours are wicked. Mm. Like, I've never really had juniper berries before, so that's mm-hmm. quite a nice okay. flavour. And um, the salmon's really well done. Um, I feel like I should have done some sort of food description course now. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, it's really, really nice. It's, it... And it tastes healthy, so... Wow. Yeah. This marks out a 10 in terms of taste, flavour. Still tucking in there. So we're looking at nine. Nine, wow. Almost. Wow. wow. Mm. Oh, Good thank result. you. I'm not just so saying that because you're sat right yeah. next to me. No, no. And you could probably throw your curry chef of the year yeah. Yeah. plates at me. <laughs> because Gubbs is a very really fast nice. eater. Yeah. You know, no, and but, but he would tell you the truth. Gubbs is, is, is right, though, because normally with Indian food, the spices take over, but with mm. my recipes, it, it's the actual ingredients that... Uh, that are yeah <laughs> it's the ingredients you can taste so if you use salmon and tomato you want to taste it you just don't want to taste dorka shorka which is great but you know it's it's good stuff so I, I actually created this recipe for the james whale fund for kidney cancer can i talk a little bit serious for Please, a minute yes yes because i think i have to sometimes uh, yeah. you know uh, but they're, they're holding a big curry party between um the 17th of october and 21st of october to raise awareness for people who suffer from kidney cancer now i've become interested in kidney cancer because it's a, what they call a cuckoo in the nest cancer because it's it's not recognized uh you know people don't know a lot about it so even doctors themselves aren't very aware to diagnose it so every year we get eight thousand people who suffer from it and around half of them will die so what i'm asking people to do is um you know during that time is cook a curry because asians we cook we eat curry all the time so cook a curry and i know times are tight but maybe just give a pound each to the kidney cancer fund because no one's helping these poor people i'm really it's a very we need important to do something. message. No, yeah. absolutely. Thank we you. We need very to raise much. awareness. Yeah. Thank you very much for sharing that with us. And then there's something on a happier note. Something I'm really excited about. Can something I talk I'm more very excited something? about. But yeah, you what? tell me your excitement. What are you first? No, you first. Ladies no, 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 first. you first. Okay. Now we've got the World Curry Festival, 23rd to 25th of September. Okay. And this is happening in Leeds. Um, it's a non-industry event. Anyone can go up there. If you love curry, it's curry heaven. You can try Indian curry. You can try South Sounds Indian really curry. Sounds really good. What, what uh, date? Thai curry, 23 to 25 September. It's the only event, uh, as where? far as I know, where, where, in where, the where? world. Leeds in 
in the hedgerow. It's next to the Radisson in in Leeds. So it's in the city centre. Curry basically. festival. It's a world curry festival. Uh, there's cookery demonstrations from the world's leading curry chefs, including myself. And there's Vivek Singh from the Cinnamon Club. Um, have you heard? You, well, you would have heard of Anjali Patak, the heiress from the Pataks people. There's um, the Hem- Hemant Oberoi. And now what's different is with all other food festivals in the UK, they focus on uh, all different types of food, but not curry. Now, if you can't make it to Leeds, which is, you know, a bit, you know, it's not, I'm not happy if you can't make it to Leeds to see me, but if you can't make it, you can just pop into a Morrison's who are doing loads of deals on curry and, believe it or not, beer and stuff. So everyone can take part in the World Curry Festival, wherever That's you are. brilliant. Thank mm-hmm. you very, very much You're for welcome. that. welcome. Brits turn to curry for comfort during the washout summer, according to Buddocks, who saw a 16% rise in sales. That's in the papers today. Really? I'm, mm-hmm. Something I'm, I've got to pick that He's, up from Gubbs you. has yeah. nearly finished the, <clears throat> your curry. I'm just eating. He's just been Sorry, quietly I'm... sitting there as yeah. our taster has yeah. ended up like finishing the lot nearly. Was I not supposed to finish it? No, 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 you are. Oh. No, no. Well, we do like on the show sometimes share it with the rest of the BBC oh, Network stuff. But don't worry, more. don't worry. Oh, have you? You've got yeah. loads more? Yeah. Uh, and we've got, hang on, I've just been told that there's an email that's come through. So let me just find that. Uh, this is um, from Suman. Your recipe is mouthwatering. And I will have a go at it. Most importantly, I'm pleased that you've mentioned goji berries. The benefits of these berries are immense. A word of caution, there are many varieties of goji berries and they are expensive. However, it is possible to grow goji berries in this country and they will take to our gardens, says Simon. That's absolutely correct. I mean... Yeah. Uh, the climate change farms towards Devon have been growing them for quite a while, but they are very um, easy to grow in your garden and also on your windowsill. And they're not that expensive. I picked up a bag, sorry, Suman, it's a Suman, right? Yes. But I picked up in the Chinese store a 500 gram bag for 289 or something, 239. Now, I yeah. must interrupt you because yeah. your exciting news was about the curry festival, mm-hmm. and I said that I'm I've so got excited. some exciting yeah. news as well, and that is that we found your mum. Hello, Mrs. Baines. Oh, Hello. Gosh. Hello, Sasha Galanti. Congratulations, Mubaraka, Thirty Mundane Award Yes, Curry Festival 2011. Yeah, Chef of the Year. Chef of the Year, yeah. Hanji, Tonapata Award to see how do you feel to see Keno? Thank you, Kanna Chonia. I'm proud. Boy. Very proud. Yeah. Oh, that's so sweet. Aww. Thanks, Mum. Oh, that's good boy, Auntie. I'm uh, very good boy. Very good boy. Auntie? Yeah, such a very good boy. Hey, hey, I'm going to room room tidy. Oh, my God. I do live outside of home. I'm going to tidy up. I'm going to tidy up. Oh, my God. And Auntie, you know. I'm going to tidy up. I'm going to tidy up. Yeah. Yeah. So, what do you want to do, Auntie? I want to salmon. All uh, the stuff like it. She's my uh, same Quite pretty fit curry. Food. But anyway, I like the salmon uh, he cooked for me last week, twice. She was uh, my guinea pig, yeah, for this immune boosting yeah, curry. Yeah, he, <laughs> he cooked this morning again. Oh, <laughs> that's nice, Auntie. Yeah. Has he always been a good cook? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's always a good cooker. Oh, did he learn from you a little bit? Yeah, yeah, he did learn from me a little bit. Then he's curry. How many is... On curry, I mean cooking from long while. Oh. Indian cooking from long while. Think more boys in our community should cook. Yeah, yeah. It's nice curry cooker. <laughs> and what have you made today, Auntie? Oh, come on, get it together, Mum. No, I just went to the garage, I'm a cook car, like you see. I just started cooking now. What are you cooking? Um, what am I having for dinner when I come back from Birmingham today? Because <laughs> I don't normally live at home, but I'm on my way to Leeds. It's kind of like, you know, I don't want to head back to London. So what's for dinner tonight, Mum? I'll uh-huh, go in the kitchen and have a look. I don't know. <laughs> I've got nothing in my mind, but I'll go and have a look at the <laughs> I've got nothing in my mind. There's a good book there, <laughs> Indian Superfood, Mum. <laughs> Pick it up and cook something from there. Uh, oh, do you want I've to... got my granddaughter with me to look after. Oh. Hi, I'm Elise. Hi, I'm Elise. Yeah, she's with me. <laughs> That, in other words, that says yeah. means that's code for get a takeout on the way home. No, I'll just cook when I get back. When you cook. Oh, yeah, yeah. that's of course. Of course, you can cook as well. Mm. Oh, Auntie, it was lovely talking to you, Auntie. Yeah, nice, yeah, so do I. Do you want to give a message to anyone? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a child. You're 
pretty shy. Oh, <laughs> do you, we love you. Thank you. Thank you. See you later, bye. mom. Okay, bye. Tell your mummy, lover. <laughs> I love you, mum. You've been. I hope you were listening because we got you. Yeah, told yeah. You. I'm listening to you anyway. Millie, your dad, and me, both are listening to you. Yeah, Millie, everyone. Free fans. Free musketeers. Uh, do, does your uncle know I love you, Kado? Oh, hello. Yeah. She's, she's laughing. Auntie? Uh, yeah. Auntie, does your uncle know I love you, Kado? Uncle, look at I love you. Oh. She never say that. <laughs> Auntie, what do you say? What do you say? You don't say that. Auntie, uncle, know I love you, Kado? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie, what do you say? I'm going to get a time. Ho gaya. Auncle, I love you, Kado, uncle. No. What do you say? You know me, don't you? <laughs> Oi. Auntie! <laughs> Auntie, just say I love you, uncle. Not uncle, but just say I love you to your husband. Go on. <laughs> Auntie! <laughs> Auntie, just say I love you. Another time, no? <laughs> <laughs> She's still not doing it. Oh, God, it's incredible. Good fruit veins, thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, thank you for being on the show. Oh, my God, I enjoyed it so much. We've got to do it more often. <laughs> thank you. Right, if they want to follow you on Twitter, it is... I'm on Twitter, Indian Superfood, and Facebook, Indian Superfood. I'm there, I'm everywhere. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> now, thank you. Asian Britain on digital TV and online.